And a warm welcome. Our venue today is the Etihad Stadium here in Manchester. I'm Derek Ray, and I'm joined for expert analysis by Stuart Robson. I'm very much looking forward to bringing you action from the Premier League. It is Manchester City, and they take on Sheffield United. Yes, thanks as always, Derek. We've got two good teams here, so I'm anticipating a really good game. The atmosphere is electric inside the stadium before kickoff, and hopefully we're not disappointed. Introducing the starting players for Manchester City. Ederson begins in goal. Nathan Ake plays with Kyle Walker as fullbacks. Bernardo Silva plays alongside Kevin De Bruyne in the centre of midfield. And the lone striker today is Erling Haaland. And this is how the starting eleven looks for Sheffield United. John Fleck plays alongside Sander Berge in central midfield. And the tactical configuration has two players in attack from the very outset. Thank you for attending the Etihad Stadium. Enjoy the match. And the match begins. Bernardo Silva. Oh, it's a superb challenge. Very timely. The defenders know you can't really allow space like that. But nothing comes of it. And support available. Now what can they do from here? In search of space. And teammates to play it to. It's looking promising. Can he finish? And keeping it out. A short corner. Throw into Manchester City. Rodri. On to Holland. Holland. And he's broken free. In it goes. The goal for 1 0. And that changes the dynamic. And back underway, 1-0 it is. Determined defending. And teammates around him. Now will the cross work out for them. And he could be in proper trouble here. Ederson, wonderful goalkeeping. So the corner played into the box. Sheffield United recovering possession well. John Fleck. Big chance to get them on terms. And denied by the keeper. Impressive. Counter-attacking chance. Holland. Now, can they take advantage? Well, it looks so promising, but it all comes to nothing. Berge.
How can he take them on and beat them? And saved by the keeper. Using all his defensive acumen to cut it out. Now options are plenty. But timely defending when it mattered. Well, Sheffield United have seen more of the ball in the last 15 minutes. And they've created chances. It just now needs one of those chances to be taken. But you feel it's coming. Yes, it's so true. For once they find themselves in defensive mode. Ball back with Sheffield United now. The cross is on. Could be. Is he going to put it away? Well, they're going to be very cross with themselves because that was a wasted opportunity. And taking it away. Can he finish? Everson and goal made it look easy. Said he could be onto something. And options in the centre. And so the first 45 minutes have come and gone. Away they go again. Second half is underway here. Excellent defending. De Bruyne. De Bruyne threading it through. Kevin De Bruyne. Well, that's how to keep the opposition at bay. Well, you might say par for the course as far as Erling Haaland was concerned in the first half. Stuart, your thoughts? Well, I thought he had a really effective first half. Not only did he get the goal that gave them the lead, but his general play was really good. He was a constant threat, and I'm sure we'll see more of him in the second half. And a wretched cross, really, over everyone. Holland And Grealish. Well, the fans really want him to shoot. And a goal it is for Manchester City. They are the team on course for victory. Goal for Manchester so, 2 0 now. Number 47, Phil Foden. Berger. This is a message for all away supporters. Illegal play, and hence a free kick. They will now make use of their substitutes bench. Well, no problems defensively. Bodies forward and the break looks on. George Baldock to be replaced by number 23, Ben Osborne. Norwood. Oh, beating his opponent with ease. Can he finish? No way through. Silva. De Bruyne with options. Well, it's a really poor challenge. Now, what's the referee going to do about it? Simple save, really. Oh, managing to beat him. They keep plugging away. Well, the keeper reacted magnificently. 
A long way from the perfect pass. Can he finish? Full credit, wonderful stop. Short corner favoured. John Fleck. And fine goalkeeping. Growing pressure here, and another corner. Trying to pick out a teammate. Well, not cleared away completely. Norwood. John Fleck. And cutting inside. And defensive play to be applauded. And so into the final five minutes. Well, at first glance, you would think a strong possibility of a red card. Let's see. And that will change the equation quite profoundly, Stuart. Absolutely, but it's a poor challenge. The referee had no other option but to send him off. Well, options at the back post here. But it's actually ended up being easy meat for the keeper. Good-looking sequence. Opportunity! Oh, good save. One terrific save after another. Well, there's the final whistle, and Manchester City have come out on top in this game. Your verdict.